When I think of my mom, I think of many things. Her love for art, her Michelle Obama arms, her frequent sneezes. But above all, when I think of my mom, I think of poodles. So today we're making these precious fondant poodles in honor of my mom's favorite animal. Here's what you'll need. Poodle colored fondant, a little white fondant for the eyes and a little pink for the tongue. Piping tips to cut out the eyeballs. A few toothpicks. Glue made from gum paste dissolved in water. A small paintbrush. A dusting pouch. A knife tool or just a knife. A molding stick or something to roll out fondant for the eyes. And a grater with a spiky side. Now if anyone ever told you that making fondant poodles was easy, they were lying. But raising me was no walk in the park either. Right, Mom? First, we're going to form an egg type shape for the body. For the front legs, you'll make a little worm and then form that into a U. A disc shape creates the back legs. Brush glue on the legs and attach the body. Use the knife to make a small indentation where the back legs would be separated. Now turn it around and do the toes. For the head, use your index finger to bring the nose to a point. Form a piece of fondant into a surfboard shape for the ears and cut it in half. Pinch each ear at the top and attach it to the head. Take a ball of fondant and roll it over the spiky side of a grater to create the frizzy look of the poof. Now when it comes to the poof, I say the bigger the better. I mean, who doesn't love a big herd poodle, right? I would even encourage you to step into the danger zone a bit. If necessary, call in reinforcement. All better. Roll the tail into a light bulb shape using your index finger. Then roll the fat part on the grater for texture. Dab a little glue in the butt and attach the tail. I like to give it a curl to the side. The nose is pretty self-explanatory. Roll out the white fondant and cut out two eyeballs with a number seven piping tip. Next, roll out the black fondant and cut two dots with a number four piping tip. Carefully glue the eyes together and then onto the poodle. If you have a food safe marker, just draw in black dots and make your life a whole lot easier. Pull the tongue like taffy. Then glue it to the chin and give it a curl for fun. And voila! A world with another poodle in it is a better world indeed. Happy Mother's Day, Mom!